community-gamers.com. Link to it down in the description below. You can find people to play with, a bunch of friendly different people, and the minimum age you have to be is 13 years or older. So again, communitygamers.com. Link down in the description. Go ahead and check it out. Two Star Trek AK-47 Aquamarines field tested, two winners. If you guys want to enter this giveaway, all you guys have to do is leave a like rating and have your playlist public. Subscribe, join the quad squad, and leave a comment down below in the comment section. All right, my quad squad, how's everybody doing? It's the man, the myth, the legend, Quad MFT here. Come back at you guys again, of course, with another Counter-Strike video. Today, we're going to be going over two important things, one being the update that just came out about 45 minutes ago, as well as the other thing being talking about the possible future operation maps, which we're going to go over and, of course, show pictures and link down in the description. So first off, the brand new update that just came out today, November 4th, not that big of a deal, literally. Only five megabytes. It's not really that important. I'll actually link the post to it from the Global Offensive subreddit down in the description below. Credit to Wicked Player 494 for posting this, as well as it says, looks to be nothing of note aside from a local sync of recent Steam datagram configuration changes, which swap up two ranges of Atlanta data, tracer, data center IP ranges for one single new range. As for anything else, it looks like just to be a bunch of small coding that was changed. Not really quite sure how that affects gameplay. I don't really think it does. But either way, I will link that one down in the description below. If you guys would like to look a little bit more into it personally, of course, go ahead and do so. I just really don't understand it, and I don't think it was really meant to be that important. But I do want to keep you guys updated on everything having to do with CSGO updates. Hey, that's another reason why you guys should subscribe. We're working our way up to 150k subs. It means a lot to me. Just another reason. As well as now we can get to the part where we talk about the future operation maps. And actually, this post was made, again, on the Global Offensive subreddit one day ago talking about how these supposed future operation maps were just updated now first off i know i we i don't know i'm going to tell you straight up i don't know when the new operations coming out i don't know what maps are going to be included i don't know the name i don't know the date i really don't know anything and this is all just speculation and just talking about what they possibly could be and what could lead towards it actually happening sooner or later it doesn't matter when it does come out i'll show you guys gameplay of all the new maps i'll keep you guys right when it comes out within an hour I'll let you guys know when it, that, that it's out and that that I have gameplay of it and all that stuff, all that good stuff. So the first thing that was actually updated are two new maps. The first one being Light. Light was also updated today. Now, what I could take from act, this actual subreddit post over on Global Offensive was that a lot of people were replying that when a new map is updated, when a really popular map in the workshop is updated, as well as a couple others at the same time, this can definitely signify that a new operation is coming. Now, we've all been wondering... We've all been saying, when is a new operation coming out? I, we want a new operation. Everybody wants a new operation. It brings something upbeat. It brings something new with Counter-Strike. It's, it's really, really fun whenever operations come out. You get the new coin. You get the, to complete the new missions. You get new maps. Overall, it's a really, really good time. And typically, a new case comes out with it as well. So that's also fun as well. I'm really, really interested. But back on topic to the light map. I will link this one down in the description below. You can see that it says it was last updated November 2nd at 524 p.m. So this is very, very important. Let me tell you guys. This is very important it's it's another sign that you know valve or or steam whatever you want to call it gaben even is actually preparing for this map to be in the brand new operation so we could be seeing a new operation really really anytime it could be coming out today it could be coming out tomorrow the next day it could be coming out in a month it could be coming out in three months we don't know if you guys would like to you could go down in the comment section below and tell me what day you think the brand new operation is coming out you could tell me why you could tell me your speculation if you have any actual reasons or if you're just guessing go down in the comment section below and tell me because it's very very interesting so this map the one that i'm showing you guys pictures of again credit to whoever made it i will link it down in the description below it says created by ted so credit to ted it does show off really really cool sort of a night theme and we don't really see i don't i don't know if we see any night maps in csgo this map kind of reminds me of cash a little bit just the overall theme of it not really necessarily the map layout kind of the, the kind of the map the kind of layout kind of looks like nuke as well but i really don't know i'm gonna see how i see, i'm gonna have to see how this one plays sheesh excuse me for all the stutter but still it kind of looks like nuke kind of looks like cash I want to say what site is this I want to say it looks like a site maybe B site no uh, I, I don't think it shows I think it maybe might be a site there's a little a on, on right on one of those boxes maybe I don't know maybe on the back of the wall too in green but still it looks like a site kind of reminds me of cash kind of reminds me of inferno I'm gonna go with cash but it kind of has that nuke layout not gonna not gonna preemptively say that I hate this map because I hate nuke with all all my passion is my worst map ever no matter what i suck at nuke i hate it i don't enjoy it i've tried trust me i know don't knock it till you try it well i've tried it plenty of times 
double digit times, 20, 30, 40, 50 times, and I hate it. I really do. Okay, so that's light. Again, a brand new update. Not really quite sure what this brand new update did, but it did it did update light. So that's that's very huge. That shows that this is probably going to be in the operation. Again, not guaranteed. But as for light being updated today, there was also another map called Austria that was updated. And this one is a snowy map that you guys can see. Credit to Radix, of course, for checking this out, for actually creating this map, I believe. I will link this post on the Steam Community Workshop down in the description below. This one reminds me a lot of different Call of Duty maps. <laughs> you guys are probably going to hate on me for saying that just because I know everybody who plays CS or at least a lot of you guys who say, yes, yeah, CS is the best. Fuck God. All that shit because a lot of you guys guys believe it or not or at least a decent amount of you guys went from call of duty 2 counter-strike or at some point have played call of duty and say it fucking sucks or something I, there, you don't meet a lot of people in csgo who say oh yeah dude call of duty is amazing you, <laughs> that's not a very common occurrence at all but this this one was actually updated november 3rd at 6 a.m so just about like 30 hours ago or something like that this was updated of course kind of low-key signifying that there's probably going to be in a new operation very soon and this one is this map is probably going to be included in it i don't know why all these maps because we do have another one after this these maps that everybody is speculating to be in the operation or for some reason might actually be guaranteed in the operation that i just haven't seen i don't know yet but these ones in my opinion that i'm speculating to be a part of the next operation are all just just for some reason updated at the same time so again this map looks pretty cool i like the layout i don't remember in the last operation there was a map i think it was royal i think it was royal the, the format kind of looks similar to this one and believe it or not i i consistently played that operation map and i <laughs> riley and i would always find people on royal because you know when when you're killing in matchmaking and you you, you set the operation maps or whoever the hell whoever the hell manages to get leader of the party for some reason sets these weird ass maps and you end up getting a map on CSGO that you're playing that you don't enjoy. I don't know how that happens. I don't know who fucks up, but it happens to me all the time. How do you how, how do you how do you fuck up? How do you fuck up? You choose what maps you play in CS. How how at any time do you ever play a map that you don't enjoy? I don't know how that happens, but it would somehow happen and we would end up playing random maps and we randomly played Royal. For some reason, I think we did really well. And from then on, we would just play it as much as we could. And anyway, it was really, really fun. But this map kind of looks like Royal. It's got that sort of round center middle. Somebody starting at like a lower point and the other team starting at like a higher point sort of. But it does look really good. I'm excited. This one, again, is called Austria. So I'm assuming it takes place in Austria but uh either way I do like Austria and I do like light that looks really cool as well so thrill here we go this is a map that has a lot of speculation for the brand new operation around it. It was actually updated today, November 4th, at 10.20 a.m. Now, when I'm reading this post, this post on the Global Offensive subreddit that said the future operation maps that were recently updated being light in Austria, and also saying that Thrill was updated two weeks ago, this post was made yesterday, so it was saying that it was uploaded, or, uh, updated two weeks ago. It has now been updated more recently. It was now updated literally today, literally seven hours ago. That's crazy. That's just another even even further proof or even even further like reason to entirely speculate to just just more reason to believe that the new operation is going to include this map thrill now thrill obviously being a gorgeous map this one is actually made by three different people yanzel squad and bubkez of course these will be linked down in the description below if you guys would like to go and check it out on the steam community if you guys want to drop a thumbs up on it there maybe drop a thumbs up on this vid too at the same time but still so this one is a roller coaster park i believe a it says wonder garden park has been taken over by terrorists trying to take up a take up the thrill up a notch thanks to Mapcore community for the help and feedback so this one is it looks like a map that we've never seen before at least a style of map that we've never seen before I, I believe this is an abandoned theme park that's that's really fucking cool to be honest I can't imagine this would ever go competitive but I don't know not not that the the, the looks of the map really matter again this one I don't know why this one reminds me of nuke 2 maybe I'm just not looking at it correctly or something <laughs> why do all these maps remind me of nuke I really hope they're not like nuke I, re I really hope they're not like like nuke because I suck dick and nuke i'm really bad but this one another signification that this is probably going to be in the operation i really don't see why it wouldn't be everybody's saying this is an incoming operation this is a sign of the new operation coming so if valve does decide to release the operation in the next couple days you already know i'll have videos out but from what i've seen in my previous like csgo i don't want to say like csgo I don't know, lifestyle, or whatever, my CSGO life, I've seen that a lot of the updates come around 4, 5, or 6 p.m. P 
PST. PST being Pacific Standard Time. You guys know that West Coast time. So if you're on the East Coast, it's come around around 7, 8, or 9 p.m. around there. That's typically when the updates come out. And, and I do think that they this next update that does include the operation, again, I don't know the name. I don't know the date. Whenever it does come out, it will come out around 4, 5, or 6 p.m. PST. That is my guess. Again, I don't really have any like educated guess that I can make on when the operation is going to come out. But it's probably going to be the next big thing that we'll get. I don't think there's going to be any. I, I pray to God there's no like brand new gun like the R8 Revolver. I think there will be a brand new case with it. I don't really know what else they're going to do. It would be cool if they did like a little winter update and made like Winter Dust 2. I talked about that in one of my last update videos, how Winter Dust 2, there's actually a, a map on the community, on the community workshop for Winter Dust 2, and it looks really cool. And that would be fun just because Christmas and seasons are coming up. Christmas and seasons, or holiday season is what I'm trying to say. Sorry. That would be really cool. And overall, this is just the overall, the, the, the speculation and reasoning behind why I think the new operation will probably come out in the next week or two is because all these maps that were speculated to be in a part of the, the next operation were all updated, hmm, for some reason in the past, you know, 24, 48 hours, all at the same time. And that's typically what happens when Valve or Steam is releasing new operations. So hint, hint, I don't know. Is what's Valve, Valve trying to tell us? I don't know. It's going to be cool, and I'm very, very, very excited for a new operation in CSGO. It'll definitely bring some life to it, and I'm looking forward to it. Subscribe, join the Quad Squad, click the thumbs up button if you haven't already. As well, if you guys want to, go over to CSGORoll.com, use code QUADMFT and get some free coins over there if you would like to. Link to that down in the description below. Also, if you want to check out some of my other videos, I post multiple videos on CSGO every single day, so make sure to go and check those out. They're all over my channel. There's a bunch of different playlists for tons of different types of videos. I'm sure you'll find one that you like. It's been your boy Quad. I'm Addy5000. If you guys made it all the way to the end of this video go down in the comment section below and comment the word thrill t-h-r-i-l-l -L. comment that down in the comment section below i'll try to apply to a bunch of you guys and if you haven't tell me what day you're speculating for the operation to come out and what you'd like to see specifically part of it it's been your boy quad i'm addy 5000 i'll see you fudging later peace out we'll see you Reaching out.